in this video we are going to design the first five slides of the simplicity powerpoint theme let me show you the first five slides this is the first slide these two slides and these two this is the first one the second one third fourth and fifth these five slides we are going to design in powerpoint now let me show you the preview of the slides i have just made some minor improvements to make it look good and the exact flower background i couldn't get so i just replaced it with a better image so regarding the fourth and fifth slide i have changed or tweaked the background a bit let me show you here see this slide has got plain background I will start with a plain background and I will tell you how to change it to a gradient background like this. So it's your wish and it's upon you to choose a plain or a gradient background. Now let's start with a new slide. Delete all the components. Go to insert and a text box type simplicity that's all now change this to roboto font and increase the font size make it bold let me add a dot That's it. Now we need to add these off squares. So go to insert, shapes, and let me insert a square. Hold shift key to draw a perfect square. Now go to shape fill and select no fill. Okay. Actually, you can choose any color you wish, but here you can also choose aqua accent 2. If you are not getting these set of colors, then go to design and expand colors and choose blue green. Once you have chosen that, you will get these color sets. Now, let me increase the width or the weight of the outline. Two and a quarter points is enough. Here comes the important step let me zoom in by holding control key and scrolling the mouse wheel right click edit points right click on this segment delete segment right click on this point and delete point that's it now make a click here zoom out control c control v that is copy paste now i'm going to rotate this Choose the font and let me apply this color. Similarly, the same color for the shapes too. Now place it, place these off squares surrounding the text. Select all, press Ctrl G to group them together. Now align it center, align it middle. This is the first slide, but we can improvise it by changing the design, format background, and let's choose this fill. This adds a minor yellow tint compared to the pure white. So now we are going to design this second slide. select all delete now go to insert pictures i have downloaded already this golden gate bridge well you can download an image like this by searching san francisco gate or san francisco bridge or golden bridge golden gate bridge in google 
after downloading that insert this image now push it to one side and expand it now we need to add a rectangle Now go to shape outline and choose no outline. Go to shape fill and choose the same aqua color and expand format shape. Then increase the transparency. Now copy this and paste it here. But we need to do a few things before moving it. First of all, we need to reduce the font size and then reduce the whole group size. Now go to Drawing Tools Format tab and Text Fill to White. Let's move it here and double click to select this shape alone. Then Shape Outline to White. Similarly, double click to Select this shape alone and change it to white. So, partial step has got completed. Let's increase the size and move it to the center. Let me copy this text. Come back here, go to insert text box click here and paste it okay the text you can type anything but after typing go to home and align them to right also the font is roboto font size is 18 and then make the first word that is simplicity as bold and the last word enjoy as bold that's it you have completed designing this slide. Now let's move on to the slide 3. So click new slide. And as usual, delete everything. Go to insert pictures. Choose the floor. Now you can copy all these from the previous slide and paste it here. Move them to the left. Change the color of this background rectangle to a dark ice blue. And then change the text fill to aqua. Similarly, the borders. Now select the simplicity, change it to aqua color. Similarly, enjoy and change it to aqua color. That's it. We have completed designing the slide 3 2. Now let's move on to slide 4 that is designing this slide new slide delete all go to insert and then a rectangle go to align center align middle now no shape outline but choose the shape fill to the same icy blue. Copy this simplicity logo and paste it here. Copy this text and paste it here too. But we need to resize it. 
like this and now let's position this text here and align it to left but you can see the font is different we need to change from roboto to roboto condensed powerpoint professional and customization so totally four lines now we have got the exact resizing let's position it like this and this one here now we need to design this title logo and page number go to insert and text box type general introduction change it to roboto font bold and increase the text size actually the text size here is 36 so let's use the same one here too after that select introduction and assign aqua color now go to insert shapes take a line and draw it from the bottom of this introduction to the top of this L holding shift key so that you can draw a straight line. Now increase the weightage of outline to four and a half points and change the outline color to aqua. Press right key, right arrow to align this gradually. Select both of them. Press Ctrl C, Ctrl V, and move it here. Now press Ctrl G to group them together and reduce this font size to 28 and the color to gray. your logo now copy this group and paste it again and place it here change it to page 05 or 04 that's it we have designed this slide 4 but now you can choose gradient fill and choose any color in this second row I have chosen this top spotlight accent 5 you can also choose accent 2 or accent 1 based on your preference this adds a nice touch to this slide but after adding this gradient your font of logo and page won't be that visible so you can change it to this color or this one this will make it a bit subtle now we need to design this last slide so let me add a new slide delete all we can just use these components from the previous slide so let me copy everything control c Control V. We can do like this, or instead of creating a new slide, I can just right click and duplicate this slide. Let me drag and bring it here. Now I can change the contents of this slide as per the slide that I need to design. For example, let's change this one to welcome and change the color to aqua so the introduction into message and change the color to black see half of the work is already over now let's delete this one or let's ungroup this one by going to selecting it 
going to group and group or you can press Control shift g to ungroup them now let's delete this one alone okay now go to insert pictures and this profile picture now select these two press ctrl c and ctrl v let's bring them here now select all these three and press ctrl g to group them together now we need to change this text alone what's the text here hi there john doe founder okay let's delete it select it right align change it to white and select these text add italics that's it we have completed designing all the slides